welcome back to McNulty's Book Corral. Today, guess what I got in the mail? I got the final shipment from Edgar Rice Burroughs Incorporated. These are the final four Tarzan novels, so I'm going to open it now. I was waiting for them because I saw that there were people, uh, other booktubers who had received them and had posted unboxing them. Seems to be a good idea. Let's unbox these babies so we can read them. I have myself here a bone-handled knife, which we'll be using to cut this open and not cut myself. You know, whenever, you're, whenever cutting, cut away from yourself so you don't injure yourself. And we'll talk about that, why that is a funny, funny story in my family, because I've done that and uh, the other way, and I've injured myself. Uh, it's, it's, it's a long story. Let's, let's just not go into it right now. By the way, good bone-handled knife. You need to have one. All booktubers should have a good bone handle knife on hand uh, so that you can uh, unbox stuff like this. <coughs> All right, let's take a quick look here. And we have, oh, Pulp Fest. They're going to be at Pulp Fest. And that is going to be, ooh, that's possible. We'll see. I haven't been to a pulp convention in quite a few years, so I don't know if I'm going to do any more. I'm not going to have a table. Uh, I will not do that. But uh, let's just take a look here. Get these. These are the last four. And uh, look at that. We have this all set here. And let's get these open and take a look at them. And I'll scan the covers so you can get a better look at the covers. For those of you who have not been on board with these, uh, you can now get on board with these. Uh, here is the first one to show you, which is number 21, Tarzan the Magnificent, with fantastic cover artwork by Joe Jesco. Beautiful. I love these books. There you have Edgar S. Burroughs on the back. These are just beautiful books. This is the fifth episode on this reprint series, and it's the final episode because they are now done, and the Edgar S. Burroughs family is working on the John Carter series, the Mars series, and Joe Jesco, who did the cover artwork on these, is doing the cover artwork on those. And he's on Facebook, and he has revealed a little hint of that already on his Facebook page. So I am in, I'm on for that. That's going to be awesome. Great. Oh, that's a really cool picture of uh, Edgar Rice Burroughs. <clears throat> Tarzan in the Foreign Legion. Beautiful. Look at that. That is number 22. Tarzan in the Foreign Legion coming right up here. And let's get another one. Tarzan and the Madman, number 23. There's that one. <laughs> this is a great picture of Edgar Rice Burroughs up there with Cheetah. And uh, the last one is number 24, Tarzan and the Castaways. Oh, my God. Joe Jesco uh, is one of the greatest artists of all time, in my opinion. Look at the beautiful artwork and... Edgar Rice Burroughs. So this is the final, this is the final update on the series, the reprint series from the family, Edgar Rice Burroughs, and I am so happy to have these. They're going to go right down here with the rest of them, but I have to read them first um, because I reread them. For those of you unfamiliar with this, the um, the these reprints come up with a, a variety of supplemental material on the back, letters and illustrations. Here's a page of comic book covers and various things, some original illustrations, on and on. Um, really fantastic uh, material. And here are some of the uh, previous paperbacks, which if you remember when I first did my first episode on Burroughs, I showed you my, my uh, paperback collection. I have two sets. <laughs> but yeah, it's the way it is, guys, okay? Uh, now I have another set. I have a beautiful hardcover set with Mars coming. Mars is coming. Um, it will probably take them a couple of years to get that material together. So we're going to have these to go. I am just so thrilled to have these. Last four of the uh, deluxe hardcover uh, officially uh, produced by the family of Edgar Rice Burroughs. And they have really outdone themselves. They've set the standard high for how pulp fiction reprints should be done. And this is where it's at. 
and uh, no other company can outdo this. No other company, no other author than the Edgar Rice Burroughs family is it uh, for me. This may be the most important episode I've ever done. Because <laughs> now I have, I have all 24 of them. So I get to read the last four again. Um, if you're an Edgar Rice Burroughs fan, everything that I'm telling you and my enthusiasm should be uh, fairly commonplace, your understanding of that. Um, for those of you who haven't taken a look at it, at least get the first four and see where you're at. I think the series really takes off me, it's personal opinion. Uh, the first Tarzan book, of course, is generally considered a literary classic. But for me, it's the second Tarzan novel where the series really took off. Yeah, let's take a look at this from this very series here. The Return of Tarzan. All right, so I'll scan this as well so you get a look at it. Um, for me, this is where the series really just went, wow. Burroughs tapped into a vein of imagination, and he just went until he passed. Uh, he's probably where, wherever he is now, he's still typing away or using a megaphone to, uh, not a megaphone, a recording device to uh, um, narrate his stories, which he did. Anyways, lots of stuff to say here, but I think I've said enough because I just wanted to give everybody the, the hint of Edgar Rice Burroughs. If you have not taken a look at Edgar Rice Burroughs, this is the time to do it. I just had an episode on Valentine's Day, and uh, but I and I normally give you know at least a week before I post another one. Not all the time, but this is too important to hold, so I'm popping it in right after. Valentine's Day, and uh, that leads us to whatever happens next here at McNulty's Book Corral. So, in the meantime, you, you, thank you for checking in. Stay well, stay happy, feed your brain. Read E R B, the Tarzan series. <laughs>